right, welcome back. So we're starting at the very tip tippity tip top of the Waymo service area. And immediately we're having a interesting... Wow, we just got inches from that palm tree. Squeeze through the gap, nicely done. And hopefully at the end of this video, I have a forced three point turn for you. Should be something exciting, eh? Oh my goodness, look at all the fancy cars in this lot. <laughs> Is that a Bentley something? T Tesla, Bentley, Tesla, Tesla, Mercedes, BMW. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah! Wow! an hour. Okay. Sure, sure. And off we go. Ah, finally, unprotected left. Here's the fun part. There's a big sign kind of blocking the long distance view. Let's see exactly how long distance we got here. Oh, wow. Pretty good distance. Instead of going that way, which involves going... Oh, we're just skirting the service area boundaries here. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, we could have just gone straight, but that is not what we did. Okay, back. 
back again to the truck with the shovels. out of it. Also upcoming, we're going to do something that's been less common with the eye paces, which is snake into a neighborhood to avoid a right turn. Just briefly. That's the next turn after this one.
So, yes, we know there's some kind of a construction something going on down there. The question is, how bad is it, and can I get the car to go through it? And considering that it knows already what's going on, I'm going to probably say no. Shout out to Kevin, who's texting me from the backseat of a Waymo as well. Uh, good, good times. <laughs> oh, there's the horses. I haven't, I haven't seen those before in person. I've seen pictures. to see if we will do the weird three-point turn or not. Oh, this is why the time, the estimate is four minutes, isn't it? Because this, it's going five miles an hour. Oh. <laughs> is it going to take us four minutes to get to the back of this lot? Oh, no. Oh, no. Yep, those are nasty speed bumps, all right. <laughs> Holy cow. What are you doing, man?
Okay, well, here it is. Um. Almost there. Don't forget your belongings. There's the characteristic, I've figured out what you're doing, and now I've come to a stop. And... And... Are we going to use a parking space for this? Oh, nice. Nicely done. Okay, sure. Well, that works. <laughs> Now there's no time estimate on the screen. No... Finding a spot to pull over... What? What did you do? So we didn't pull over and stop. Oh my gosh, is it gonna try it again? Oh, it's one of these loop situations again. Okay! I'm here for the ride, sure. I can, I can be here all day. Actually, I can't really, uh, the 30% off ride promotion ends at 2 p.m., so, uh, let's hurry it up. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay, uh, yeah, go ahead and use the timestamps for this one, if you'd like. Uh, I'll let you know when we, when we attempt it again. Should I put a countdown timer? You know, uh, it might as well, right? <laughs> so... Hmm. So this is like the, the video where we got stuck in the loop. Except for it's a lot slower. Yeah, this is just comical, honestly. Round two, fight! You know, Waymo, it's, uh... Almost there. Don't forget your belongings. It's okay if you just want to drop me close-ish. I don't mind. And yes, I could just not troll this car with... Um... With a silly drop-off point. But... What am I here for, right? It's gonna do it again. There's no way, dude. Oh, okay. Nope, 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 nope. Smarter than that. Alright, alright. Ooh, wow, that was... Alright, gonna call the video here. If you made it to the end, then congratulations, because that was terrible. <laughs> You're here. Please make sure it's clear before exiting. Alright, have a nice day. Thanks for watching.